Hi, Roofers Coffee Shop. I'm Charles Antis, founder and CEO of Antis Roofing and Waterproofing. And with me today, I have my VP of Sales and Operations, Aaron Antis. Hola. And this month's question is, what are we doing to educate our customers about roofing? And that's a great question. And it's a question that I've always had in my mind and my company. In fact, 30 years ago when we were founded, I was trying to explain to the customers how to keep their roofs watertight. And I finally came up with this comparison that I think works. And I said this, in Anthos Roofing, if we had a mascot, it'd be a duck because a duck's feathers overlap feathers below and water cascades off a duck's back. And the roofing components or your wall components are the same. Everything above must overlap that what's below. So I was educating back then. Do you remember that? I do, yeah. Did you ever tell that story? I did, yes. And we still talk about the duck sometimes, but today Aaron has a number of things he does that shares with the customer and he's gonna share them with you. Yeah, so one of the things that we try to do is make it a lot more engaging, uh, make it a lot more fun experience for our uh, property managers because that's mostly what we service. Um, this was born out of kind of a selfish re reason uh, in a sense in that um, I was tired of giving the same old presentation over and over about roofing. Um, it seemed like the managers were um, not as engaged as I would like them to be. They wanted to uh, know more about roofing, but they were basically hearing the same presentation from roofers, from plumbers, from electricians, from everybody in our industry. And so we wanted to do something a little bit different. So the first thing that we actually did was uh, a Jeopardy game. It's a lot more engaging. Um, so we ask a lot of questions about roofing and we really test their knowledge. We put them into uh, teams, two, three, four people. Um, and we make them compete. So uh, they get really interactive. We make them make fun of each other. Uh, I make fun of them. It's, it's a lot of fun. Um, and then we do the exact same thing uh, with this Shoots and Ladders game right here. Uh, we actually have our own little characters that are uh, people in the company. This one's me, looks a little bit like me, um, but it is uh, a it's lot It's a of lot fun. like you. Actually. Yeah, so they roll the dice. They're, it's a lot more interactive than just sitting down and listening to a presentation about, about roofs. Uh, roofs are fun, but mostly for roofers, a little bit less for the people that uh, um, that we're teaching. So that's a little bit of what we do, a little uh, slice of what we do now nowadays. The last thing I would add to this is that Antis Roofing, we're real big about communicating in every way back to the customer and to the community. And so the way we do this is on our social media channels. We have about five channels, and in which case we have a rule that I suggest you follow because it really works. We kind of split our social media coverage into three equal buckets. There is our philanthropy, our flair, who we are, and then there is our expert branding. And our expert branding is showing the roofs, teaching about the roofs. And that's what that's what we do. So thank you, Aaron. Very well done. Thank you, you guys. Woo! See you next month.